Hello everybody, this is Boosted Bandcamp. Today we're going to be uh, talking about CGSS, Crazy Gadget, Skip Skip, and learning how to do this trick uh, using the level editor as a tool. Uh, for those who have been on this channel previously, this is not the set file editor that I made a tutorial on a year ago. This is a different one. Um, so without further ado, let's just get straight into it. Uh, first and foremost, obviously you're going to need a copy of SA2 on the PC and this editor. Uh, the editor will be linked in the description uh, on GitHub so that uh, it's easily accessible. Now, let me just, okay, well, let me just get, uh, does my save state still work? No, it does not. Okay, well, anyway, I guess while we get to CGSS, uh, I'll talk briefly about uh, basically what we're going to be doing here and the as you can kind of see on my screen already there's these red kind of boxes those are kill planes in fact the camera that you see right now is exactly pointed in a spot where you usually can't even see everything but using the tool we can uh, so now that we get this checkpoint let me grab this lever Now I do free cam because I'm big baby, blah, 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 blah. Okay. So this is where I usually do CGSS. We'll, we'll uh, load a save state. Now let's, um, let's bring this back into focus. Like I said, these are the CGSS kill plans and you see Sonic in there and we'll talk about him in a second. Uh, first and foremost, I should probably tell you how to load this in actually. So let's start from the beginning. I'm really bad at this. So once you, uh, you'll get uh, the thingy the level editor and files, you're, you're going to have to make uh, a separate folder for it. This is just mine. Here's the exe. Um, you're going to have to load in Crazy Gadget manually. And to do this, you do file, load objects, click yes. Uh, make sure you're here. Song Adventure 2 Resource GDPC. Scroll down until you see set 22, S and U. You're going to want both of these files right here. Uh, select both of them, click open. And then after a moment, bam, here we are. Crazy gadget and all its glory. Uh, this is spawn and yep, here it is. Uh, now to move around, I'm just using my mouse. Uh, so I click the scroll wheel to look around and then I scroll up Anytime and backward now. to move. That's basically how I move around. If there's another way to move, I, I don't know. Now we're not gonna just walk all the way there. There's actually something simpler that we can do. We can go to SA2, follow SA2 in real time, and boom, look, look at us. Look at us. Now, let me shrink this down a bit. Now, as you can see, as I move, it moves. Isn't that crazy? Really fun. Uh, really cool, kind of a neat thing going on there. Hey, hey there's the rest of the stage. Ha! Um, but uh, this isn't perfect as uh, even if we view the kill planes, it, it doesn't show us everything. So as, as an example, to turn on kill planes, all you have to do is view kill planes. Boom. And then there's kill planes. And then you could, I don't know, uh, do CGSS and I did it successfully on my first try. This is what we call in the business a fluke. Uh, I will die though. I wasn't paying attention or expecting to get out. I was actually trying to die. Let me die. There you go. As you can see, uh, you can tell I died, but it might be still a little bit hard to see like where. So what we're actually going to do is we're going to follow SH2 in real time without the camera, right? And then we're going to manually go down here. Amy, Tails, I'm on my way. And then you're like, Oh, there's this black screen in the way. I still can't see anything. View, deselect, view stage, boom. The only thing you are seeing right now is kill planes and Sonic. Now, if you have another monitor, you can just put this on a separate screen or you can do what I'm doing and just have, you know, each screen pretty small. Um, so I'd park it, you know, right about here, this right? This is a real pain in the butt. 
So if we try through GSS, there we go. You can see now I did that mistake on purpose. What I did there is I went, I jumped, and then I turned way too far to the left. And that's what that looks like. I'll demonstrate again. Went too far to the left. This is me not, this is me turning too fast. Well, that's me just holding too left. But let me try to. That's me turning too fast. To me trying to do it properly. Still didn't. Uh, I think I still turned a little bit too quickly there. Yep. We'll get it. And we just didn't jump there. Bear with me. I'm not learning from my own mistakes. Point being, anyway, is that I can see more or less from this screen where exactly I'm dying and what I'm doing wrong. If you're dying here, let me make if you're dying on this top kill plane, there's something wrong with like like you make your initial angle jump, you know, a little bit uh left up left upright. And then you, you kinda jank it up. You're probably janking it up too much if you're hitting it like over here, over yonder. And if you're hitting it down here somewhere, you're probably turning too fast. That's basically the gist of it. This is a kill plane sandwich. You're just trying to get into it. But let me just try it one more time. Nope. Okay. Well, it's not meant to be. I got it the first time. But um, wouldn't it be great if... I did though. Okay, I forgot how to do CGSS, but uh, basically, even me forgetting, I could still look at this and be like, this is exactly what I did wrong. Um, now you're like, well, I can't see uh, what this is doing. Like, it's hard to look at two screens at once, and you're right. So what I, what you can do is just OBS record uh, this screen, just window capture this, and um, when you fail, when you really feel like you shouldn't have failed, you know, rewind that back and you could see, okay. Uh, because a lot of the time the problem is just knowing what you did wrong. And this tool, uh, I think is great for that. So without rambling too much, that's going to be the end of the video. I hope it helped. I am sorry for talking way too much and getting CGSS first try when I needed to die and not getting it again when I actually needed to prove something. Well so. Get that being said, thank you for watching. If you have any questions, you could either um, DM me on Discord. If you don't have me on Discord, uh, just throw it in the comments section, and I will try my best to get to you uh, as soon as I can. So thank you so much for watching, and uh, have a good day.